Sani Bonani, Molueni, Dumelang, and hello. Welcome to the 2022 virtual gradu autumn graduation ceremony for the Deben University of Technology. My name is Professor Kyule Bukhile Matau. I'm the Director for Technology Transfer and Innovation at DUT. I would like to welcome our esteemed Chancellor, Ms. Nongkulule Konyembezi, our Vice Chancellor and Principal, Professor Tandom Tembu, our Deputy Vice Chancellors, the Register, Executive Deans, and members of faculty. Welcome to our graduates, their parents and guardians, family and friends, supporters and funders. I must also acknowledge my valued colleagues from the academic administration and support sector of our university and welcome to you and thank you for watching this broadcast of the virtual graduation ceremony today. DUT will now move back to physical graduation ceremony for the class of 2021. The confirmed dates and conditions assigned for the 2022 autumn physical graduation ceremony will be communicated accordingly to all university stakeholders using the official DUT communication platforms. DUT has decided to continue as planned with the 2022 virtual graduation ceremony scheduled to take place on Friday 13 and Monday 16 May 2022. The decision of the proceed with the virtual graduation ceremony was taken in order to allow students to receive their qualification, awards, certificate, which some may need in order to secure employment. This virtual graduation ceremony will be followed by the celebratory physical graduation ceremonies, whose dates will be announced in due course. In a short while, our Chancellor will constitute this virtual congregation and share her opening remarks with you. This will be followed by the conferring and awarding of certificate, diplomas, and degrees in the Faculty of Applied Sciences. The names of all graduates will appear on the graduation roll. These graduates' names will scroll on screen, and we will highlight those who have graduated cum laude and graduates who have earned the Dean's Merit Award. The graduation roll for all six faculties will be available on the DUT website. After the graduates' names have been presented to you on screen, our Vice Chancellor and Principal, Professor Tandwam Tembu, will then deliver a short address, which will be followed by the singing of the National Anthem of the Republic of South Africa. The Chancellor will then dissolve the congregation which will signify the end of this virtual graduation ceremony. Congratulations to all our graduates. You are now part of DUT alumni, and we look forward to your continued support and engagement in the years ahead. We are immensely proud of you, and we wish you success and always fortune always. We are extremely grateful and proud of our students and staff who continue to lead, succeed, and excel as strive to live values and principles of our Envision 2030 strategy. I would like now to invite the Chancellor of the Durban University of Technology, Ms. Nongkululeko Nyembesi, to formally commence with the virtual graduation ceremony and to please constitute this congregation. Madam Chancellor. Sani Bonani Nonke, good day to you all. My name is Nonkululego Nyembezi and I am the Chancellor of the Durban University of Technology. By the powers vested in me as Chancellor, I now constitute this virtual graduation ceremony for the Durban University of Technology. Congratulations to Ms. Tembim Jali Jones, who will be receiving an honorary doctoral degree, Doctor of Philosophy in Visual Arts in the Faculty of Arts and Design. Tembim Jali Jones is a multi talented, celebrated artist as a singer, actress, producer, and playwright. Ms. Mjali Jones is currently one of the leads in Imbeu, where she stars as Mandlovu. Imbeu, the seed, was produced for ETV and has been awarded the fastest growing TV drama. We welcome Dr. Tembim Jali Jones to the DUT family. 
Congratulations to our newest alumni, the graduating class of 2021. You have accomplished an enormous amount in the course of your studies here at the Durban University of Technology. You've earned your qualification and you've accomplished so much. For some, you'll be earning your undergraduate degrees, while for others, this will mark the culmination of your postgraduate and professional degrees. For all of us, though, it is disappointing that this event is not being held in person with all the traditions normally associated with graduation, a situation forced upon us due to the COVID-19 pandemic. It is my utmost wish that you remain connected with your former lecturers, your friends and your classmates. Remain steadfast as I am in the knowledge that your due to education and the relationships you've made, the learning you achieved and the experiences you had during your time at DUT will serve you well in the years to come. You are DUT for life. Madam Chancellor, I have the honor to request you to confer the degrees, diplomas, and certificates to the candidates from the Faculty of Applied Sciences who will be presented to you and whose names appear on the program. By virtue of the authority vested in me as Chancellor, I confer the qualifications to the candidates whose, who will be presented in this congregation and whose names appear on the program.
As we conclude these online proceedings, may I thank our graduates for reaching this important milestone in their personal and professional development. All that is left, dear DUT graduates, is for you and nobody else, not your family, not your friends, not your professors, not your government, not business, not industry, to leverage the knowledge, the high-level skills, and the innovations that these should spawn so that you participate productively and gainfully in the economy, whether at local, regional, national, or global levels. The economy out there is not waiting to absorb you just because you are a graduate, but rather it waits for you to find and use compelling and innovative ways to insert yourself into it. May I thank the families and the sponsors of our graduates. They supported our graduates through thick and thin over the years. Some went hungry just for you to earn this qualification. Some of your siblings sacrificed so much to give you the opportunity you got and that they may not have had and may never ever have. They all look forward to you putting your knowledge, your high level skills and the innovations these should spawn as you demonstrate those compelling and innovative ways you will choose to insert yourself into the broader society and its organs. Our ailing and COVID-19 battered economy awaits your innovations to turn it around. May I thank all of you, graduates, families, sponsors, for your understanding of these very difficult COVID-19 circumstances that forced on us an online graduation ceremony. We had all been looking forward to see you walk the stage with great pride. We had all been looking forward to hear those ululations. We must thank God, though, that we have alternative ways, including having this online graduation ceremony to celebrate. Our Chancellor, Madame Nyembezi, has always been generous with her time and support, attending as many graduation ceremonies as she possibly could, I thank her very much for availing herself to officiate online today. Finally, I thank our academics, faculty offices, the registry, for all the work they did under very difficult circumstances to process everything that was needed for our graduates to graduate today. 
I should also thank our corporate affairs, multimedia, technology, and many other sections of the university that worked tirelessly behind the scenes to make this online graduation ceremony a success. All the best to you all. Ogushe Nogum Shop. By virtue of the authority vested in me as Chancellor, I dissolve this virtual congregation of the Durban University of Technology.